What up guys, wanted to jump on the low snap here, and I actually wanted to start a campaign for the Browns to fire Hugh Jackson, make Todd Haley the head coach, make the quarterback coach, make the offensive line coach Bob Wiley, offensive coordinator, because if you have not heard about this dude, if you have not been watching Hard Knocks, it's insane. This dude is probably one of my favorite human beings ever. If you do not know about Bob Wiley, do yourself a favor, search him on Twitter, search him on YouTube, that's Bob, and then Wiley is W-Y-L-I-E, dude's insane, he will make you love life again, it's great, but one of the things that sticks out and one of the reasons I don't think Hugh Jackson is honestly fit to run this Browns team is the way he reacted to Josh Gordon coming back to Cleveland, and then how Todd Haley responds. And Todd, I mean, I'm sorry, uh, Josh Gordon coming back into Cleveland. Hugh Jackson is so excited. The bird has landed. The bird has landed, is what he said on Hard Knocks. Todd Haley's response? Has he been working out? Because he gets it. One player is not going to save this team. Josh Gordon is a great talent, but he's played in five games in the last three years, I think. And dude missed basically all of training camps, all of hard knocks the whole time they were there. A lot of the preseason. It's really puzzling to me how happy Hugh Jackson is to have this guy back who basically in like three years, which for a football player is an eternity, has played five games. You have Jarvis Landry. You have David Njoku. Rashad Higgins ain't bad either. You have a solid receiving core. And especially in the AFC North where cornerbacks and just the back end of every secondary in your division is C-plus at best. I think the Steelers have the best one. But Bengals don't have anything special. They just got rid of George Iloka. Hmm. Could be something. I don't know. I don't really like it. But the Browns have an opportunity, if they handle this correctly, to go, I think, 6-10. and 10 at, is kind of middle of the road for them. 8-8 eight and eight is best-case scenario, and 8-8 eight and eight would be a perfect situation. I don't know, guys. Just based, and of course it is a TV show, I don't know if they're portraying Hugh Jackson as like this, or if he really is like this. Best thing the Browns can do, fire Hugh Jackson, make Todd Haley, the off, make Todd Haley, who is the offensive coordinator, the head coach. And after the season, hire Josh McCown as your quarterback coach. You offered it to him a season ago, he wanted to keep playing. I think getting benched for the rookie in New York... Kind of make him realize, hey, maybe it's time to step away. Put him in as your quarterback coach, maybe even offensive coordinator if you're feeling risky. Put it together, win some games. I'm telling you, the Browns rise is here. Don't let Hugh Jackson get in your way. Could be a good offensive coordinator. He helped Andy Dalton. Maybe have him flip, although I highly doubt he would take that demotion. But we'll see how it goes. Again, guys, my campaign to fire Hugh Jackson, make Todd Haley the head coach, and to get the Browns back to the playoffs. Let's see it happen. What do you guys think? Comment below.